You're listening to the new Music Alliance Radio Hour. We're bringing it home. I'm Mistress Miriam. I'm here with Mark Ramon, and you just heard Brandy Simone. Sorry, Santa. And before that, you heard the Clappus Cousins. No chimney. And we started with Levi Schmidt featuring Kim Jennings and Dan Cloutier. A very maxi Christmas. <laughs> Yeah, let's go to Brandy, who uh, I love her music. I I, I thought I played her before, I, um, but I looked it up on our list and she she was not there. Um, this is a wonderful song, Sorry it Santa. Is. Came out in 2019. This is better than like Marilyn Monroe singing Santa Baby or whoever sings that song. I don't know. I agree. Eartha Kitt. Eartha Kitt sings Santa Baby, yeah. I mean, you know. Well, it, every it, it's its own thing. Yeah, it's she's terrific, Brandy Simone, and she doesn't play anymore. I you know. I mean, she, I don't know if she plays anymore. She's got like a real job now. She she's an owner of a a cake shop. Many layers cake shop in Florence, Massachusetts. I I, I want to have the cake. Mm. And I want I want I I want to hear the music and 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 have my cake too. Exactly. Maybe if you go buy a cake, she'll sing a song for you. I think she will. I just saw Brian Marchese a few weeks ago. And Mistress Miriam show played Luthiers. We played um, with the Fawns, and Brian plays uh, drums. He's he's I think he's one of the best drummers in the valley. He's fantastic. And he plays the shakers and tambourine and bongos on the in the woodblock on this song, Sorry Santa. He does indeed. And the jingle bells are played by Zelda Goulet. Ooh. And it's mastered by the ever brilliant Mark Allen Miller, who yep. I adore. Um from Sona Lab in East Hampton. Which he no longer it's he he no longer has Sono Lab. He has a really new, yes. He has a new he's he has a new shop. Oh, I and I wish I could remember the name of it. And he if he hears this he's going to kill me because I there's a new he's he's got a new outfit. But we'll, we'll have to chat with him again. Um, cause I think one of our early spotlights we we spoke with Mark uh, back in the day a few years ago. I, we did. We should have him on the show again because he, yeah. has a, yeah, he has a new shop. I love Mark. He's awesome. And Brandy, this is this is a great tune. Brandy out of Northampton, Massachusetts. And uh, before that, we had the Clappus Cousins, No Chimney, out of Hartford, Connecticut. Are they the? Are is that their last name, the Cla Clappus? I, be, I, you know, that's a good question. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> <laughs> the seeds of Wizard Farm music uh, were planted sometime in Hartford, Connecticut, sometime around 2010, though no one remembers for sure. Oh, yeah, Matt Clappis and his cousin Chris. They are cousins. They're the Clappis cousins. Yeah. Huh. It's a great name. It almost <laughs> sounds like it's not even a real name. That's how good a name it is for, for a band. And this is a, such a cool song to, to address the this ever persistent question: it's, How does Santa get deliver presents to an apartment? It's you know, it, there's a way he does it, and um, I'm not at liberty to talk about it. <laughs> you signed I'm, a confidentiality being in my agreement. Profession, <laughs> being a realtor. <laughs> um there is a method there's a way that it's done um it's to code it's legal oh good and, um you know because of all the little children out there we don't want to you know i just i'm not allowed to talk about it okay and so just just know that um that santa gets there the presence will be delivered the presents uh, will be delivered, but it time. makes for a great song. Yeah. <laughs> and that was uh, released in? 2020. 2020, recently. But I don't think they're doing anything since. I mean, they they were around. They, were, um, they won the Raw Hartford Musicians of the Year in 2012, in addition to Radio 104's 
2015 statewide Connecticut Battle of the Bands. That's a big one. Mm. It used to be, yeah. It used to be. I don't, you know, I don't know. 2020, if this is a Christmas 2020, this is, yeah, pandemic y. Ooh. And we started off with Levi Schmidt featuring Kim Jennings and Dan Cloutier. Uh, a very Moxie Christmas. And my wow. family's from Maine, and uh, Moxie is, yeah, very Maine, very New England. And you just had Moxie for the first time. I did. It was delicious. <laughs> Too caffeinated for me, but um, I, I, I love the song. It's such a cute song. I mean, it, um, Kim Kim Jennings is out of uh, Worcester, Massachusetts, teaming up with Levi Schmidt and Dan. Um, yeah. Where'd it go? Oh, I did. The whole album is, is, there is like, is it sponsored by Birch Beer? Is it by Records? So like Birch Beer Records uh, was formed in the summer of 2009 by singer-songwriters Dan Cloutier and Kim Jennings. And uh, Levi Schmidt um, soon after uh, recorded an album off that la uh, label. Oh. Do they, I mean, do they like to write about soda? <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> I just, I don't know. I just saw, you know, the label, record label, and they, you know, it's a Moxie Christmas. You know, <laughs> is it like a Pepsi Hanukkah? Yeah. Maybe. Cream soda, sort of, you know, New Year. Kwanzaa? <laughs> yeah. It's cream soda, cream Kwanzaa. Soda Kwanzaa. Is it, you know, a, a ginger ale sort of thing? I mean, whatever, you know. Valentine's Day with <laughs> ginger ale New Year's ginger ale New Year's very effervescent know. very effervescent the schweffer schweffervescent <laughs> um I if if they don't write about soda they should it's just a suggestion that could be your theme for a, a show in the future <laughs> <laughs> songs about soda <laughs> oh god <laughs> Do a show about Annie, and Annie. you would find some way to get a couple of Broadway tunes in there. Exactly, I would. <laughs> oh man, is this the challenge? Challenge. <laughs> oh. Well, thank you, Miriam, for joining me and being part of this epic winter holiday special of the New Music Alliance Radio Hour. Happy, happy winter and solstice and Christmas and Hanukkah and Kwanzaa and New Year's and all that to you. Thank you. And, and keep, in, keep in mind, the days are getting longer now. Yes. <laughs> on yes. the bright side. <laughs> yes. Literally on the bright side. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> and thank you for visiting with us and joining us today listening to some great original music from Western New England artists. I'm Mark Ramone here this week with Mistress Miriam. The New Music Alliance Radio Hour is brought to you by the New Music Alliance, a 501c3 nonprofit whose mission is to assist and advance the careers of talented, creative local musicians who write original music and to promote the extended Western New England area as a destination for original music writing production and performances if you like what we're doing here on the show tell your friends about it and like the new music alliance and the radio hour on our facebook pages and don't forget to check out our website newmusicalliance.org where you'll find the extraordinary essential western new england songbook a listenable anthology of many of the best songs ever written by artists from western new england and while you're there, if you support the New Music Alliance's mission, and we know you do, we'd appreciate you making a donation or becoming a member or a sponsor. If you're a local Western New England musician who'd like to have your original music considered to be on our show, send links to your songs to newmusicalliance at gmail.com. Join us next week for more great tunes from Western New England artists. And until next week, please stay safe and... Keep on listening to original local 
music. Yeah. I wish I had some jingle bells right now. Ding, 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 ding. Let's have Charles and Khalif Neville take us out today with African Eyes. <laughs>